Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Brittany and today we're going to be doing a um, tutorial review type of deal with a couple new face products that I have. So let's get started. So today I'm going to show you guys, this is by Sony Skincare and it's basically a glow elixir. You can mix it into your foundation, you can use it as a moisturizer when, your skin when you do your skincare routine. You can basically use it really however you normally use a skin elixir. And I'm just going to apply this to my face today before I go ahead and do my like foundation like off camera. But I wanted to um, touch base with you guys about this product. So I basically reached out to this lovely girl on Instagram and I was so fortunate to have her DM me back. She sent me an email so her and I were really talking back and forth via email and Instagram. She was super super nice so I just want to state that and so she sent me this in exchange obviously for content and so if you guys are following me on Instagram which I will leave my link below you guys will see how much I rave about this product that I have this on my Instagram and I have reviewed it on there but I mean obviously I'm on YouTube now so I get to do it here as well so it says shake before use so I'm going to shake it just a little bit and it says you apply three to four drops to the palm of the hands and press onto cleansed face and dry or face and neck sorry I can't speak now I also want to mention that she has the ingredients listed back here on the bottle and it's all natural organic paraben free ingredients packed with antioxidants to help you achieve that sony glow and i will also leave my code below to save you some coins i get a little bit of credit you get a little bit of credit you get a deal give yourself a gift and the ingredients are hip ha huh, ha huh, hemp seed oil jojoba oil something like that um Mariuola oil, rosehip oil, neroli oil, and sweet orange oil. So this obviously kind of smells a little bit like like the ingredients, obviously. So it's got a little hint of a scent. It's not strong. It smells like essential oil. So it like smells really good and natural. And it's not greasy. It doesn't make your face greasy. It's very hydrating, very moisturizing. And sometimes when I do apply my foundation, I just mix a tiny bit into it and it's bomb so I'm going to show you guys this and I'm just going to take this and I don't like to put too too much in the dropper just to make sure that I'm not taking too much let me set this down so I don't spill it and I'm just going to put them on my face so you guys can kind of see how this goes like I said I don't put too too much on just because that's my preference. But I mean, during the winter time, and I mean, even fall, I start to get really dry skin. This year, it's a lot better on my face. But this has helped me. This isn't my first time using this. I've been using it for a couple of weeks. And I really like it. You will see results. And as you guys can see, as you put it into your skin, it kind of gives you like a glowy like look. If you guys can kind of tell on my face. So I really, really, really recommend it. And I will leave her website link below as long, well, along with our Instagram. My Instagram, of course. And my code. So you guys can go and pick up the bottle. And I will get the price and put that into the description as well. Just because I don't know it offhand. So I'm going to actually go do my foundation and i'll be right back so hold tight all right guys so the next product i'm going to be using today is i'm actually going to be trying two different highlighters one's a highlighting palette and one's an actual like little gel type of highlighter so i'm also going to show you guys some watches but first let me just mention lush cosmetics has a highlighter and you're like, what? They make bath bombs, bath products. They make makeup products too. So when I went on vacation to Connecticut this past summer, I actually picked this up. I have not tried it. So we're going to try this today. And I will leave the price in the link as well below. Oh, let's see. So this is also animal cruelty free. It's vegan. 
and it's called Feeling Younger. And it tells you how you can use it. You can dab it in with your moisturizer or makeup, or you can obviously apply it however you kind of really want to. So it says the ingredients on the back. And let me just show you. It's also called like a skin tint. You guys can see that. But I think it looks pretty snazzy. Because in the store when I did go, it um they had obviously something open to like see so I actually had swatched it in the store and I thought it was beautiful let me just show you hopefully it doesn't fall out what it looks like and you guys can kind of see that like in person it's got like a little bit like of a pearlized sheen to it but on camera it doesn't show that and actually you really don't need a lot like this is probably too much but let me just show you a swatch I'm gonna rub it under my skin and watch how beautiful this looks like isn't that gorgeous and you know what's best is when you're tan in the summertime or hell even if you go in the tanning bed or you self tan whatever your little heart, heart desires this is beautiful and this would look so gorgeous with tan skin like i mean i'm pale as a ghost right now but if i start tanning again this winter i'm definitely gonna use this quite a bit because like look at this it's beautiful but let's see how it really works so i'm just gonna actually take a little bit and i'm gonna try it on one side now i haven't set my face or anything yet so so obviously I'm going to use my finger if I need to use a brush to blend it out then I will but let's see how this goes probably use too too much to be fair I'm really trying I promise and that wasn't so bad now since like it's so like light and like the pearls in it are really like crystallized it's not like it really matters how much you like have on your finger because it seems to blend in like to your skin as you can see. So like it's a subtle highlight but it's beautiful. Don't mind my face. I don't know why that's like that to be fair. I really have no idea. But I promise it's not from this product. But like look, ain't it beautiful? To be fair, I always get that. I think it's because I'm maybe hot because it's hot in this room. But you know what? It don't matter because I am doing a video and I'm perfectly fine and alive. And I'm not dead yet. So can't be anything bad. So on the other side, I'm actually going to try something that literally just came out not too long ago. This has been out for a little while. So I will let you guys know what it looks like the price and all of that i'll leave all of that below but it is from lush cosmetics you can buy it online or in store so the next product we're going to look at here wait for it wait for it it's the laura lee los angeles kit highlighting kit oh my god i had to swatch it when it came in like one color i promise i only did one mm, it's beautiful you can look like a glazed donut. Like, I watched the reviews for this before it came out. Oh my god. I can't wait to try this on my face. So, let's just read this first. I want to say I paid, I think they're $19, but I will double check and leave the price in the link below. Just to be certain. But, this is for light to medium skin. And... <laughs> gives the ingredients and obviously every other detail you need so it is animal cruelty free and all the other good stuff's on the back so i'm gonna get to the good part because who doesn't want to see this it's beautiful like look at this you can obviously tell that's the one i i swatched but isn't it beautiful like look look at it guys like oh my god and like it looks even prettier in person like to be fair ooh, it's gorgeous so I'm gonna actually swatch and I'm gonna tell you which ones I'm swatching first so we're gonna go on there you're gonna see it from right to left but 
in person, it's going to be from left to right. I don't know if I said right to left. You guys will see right to left and my side's left to right. So if you're holding this in person, that's what you're going to see. So the first shade I'm going to swatch is going to be diamonds. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's my, my little birthmark, pretty mark. And mind you, this is like one little, like, look at that. Like one little like circle inside of the pan. Oh my God. Look at that. This one's Glow Gal. This one is more of like the champagne color. I know like rose goldish looking shade. Oh my god. Look at that. Those are like so completely different. But like the color range is like. Do you get what I'm saying? Like it's so beautiful. And the next one's Rose All Day. This is more of like a rosy color. I think this is beautiful. You guys can probably see that, huh? Yes. That's really pretty. And then the last one is cinnamon sugar. Like, I don't know if you guys can see that very well, but I will show you. So this one is obviously a little bit more, more gold, see? Now you can see it. So the first one is more like a icy color. This one's more golden. This one's more pinky. And this one is more copperish. So now that we got the swatches, let's see how it performs. So I'm not going to even wet the brush, okay? But I'm going to go into diamonds, which was the first one I swatched. And I'm just going to put my brush... We're going to go in all four and see how it works. We're going to put it to the test. So let's see. Oh, shit. Did you guys see that? Mmm. Like, look. You're looking at me here. And it's like, okay, cool. She's got some makeup on. Can't really tell right now. And it's like, oh, shit. She's got a blinding highlight on right now. Oh, my God. Let's get a little on the news. Now, I don't even have any other product. Like, I didn't dip back in the pan yet. And, like, look. You can still see it. Can I just dip my whole face in this? Like, honestly. I'm going to take a little bit more and do my nose. And my cupid bow. Yeah, I have my nose pierced. So, if you guys see that. I'm not picking my nose, I promise. Where else do we want to highlight? Like, look at that. Like, this is subtle. The the Lush Cosmetics one. And then this is like, holy shit, you look like a glazed donut. Imagine if, hey, let's spray this. Okay, we're going to spray the brush with a little bit of Fix Plus. And we're going to see. We're going to see how this magic works. Because I am, like, literally ready to take this brush and do my entire face. But I'm not going to can hold myself back I have standards I have self-control sometimes so let's try this okay okay I'm leaving this is beyond awesome like this is bomb this is like 10 carats freaking whatever you want to call this but like look at this you literally look like a glazed donut like I'm not even gonna lie Let's put some over here. Look at that, look at that, look at that. Oh, I love it. Before we get carried away, we're gonna try our last product. So as you guys know, if you watched my last video, you saw that I had some Kylie products. Obviously, she's not new to this. She's had her line out, and these products that I posted in the last video, kind of new, kind of not. If you haven't tried it, then it's new to you as well as it is to me. So I actually have her blush called Pink Power. And I did do a swatch in the last video, but I did not actually test it. I used the Jouer palette. And I actually will put that video in the below. Or you can go to my channel and see it and see my thoughts on that. Let's just leave it at that. And you can go and see what I thought. So I'm going to watch this I have way too much makeup like look at my fingers 
think I need to wipe them off eventually. So like, look, isn't that pretty? Like for fair skin tones, I think this is beautiful. Like in person, it's more pinky toned, but I mean, obviously on camera, it's picking up kind of peachy, but in all honesty, it's more pinky. Like it looks really light on the camera, but I promise it's a little deeper than that. But it's not like too deep, you know? So I'm going to take my Beach Cosmetics Pro number two brush. I'm just going to dip into that and see how this goes. Oh, I guess it works. It works, doesn't it? I feel like it's subtle, but it's buildable. It's beautiful. Okay, did you just see what that did to that highlight? Oh my god. Don't mind my dirty ass brush though. I promise I clean my brushes. I'm gonna have to clean them all soon. But you know what? Your girl has a lot of brushes and I'm the only one that uses them. And they do get cleaned, I promise. So nobody over here is getting a lot infection. I'm the only one that uses them. But I know it's not very sanitary, but I'll shut up. Like, look. It's pretty. Like, it's subtle. You guys can kind of see. But it is pretty. That's pretty sweet. I'm just going to keep on blushing up my face. See, that looks cute. Like, look at that. It's subtle, but it's there. Like, it's there and it's pretty. I'm impressed. I'm very impressed. So, let's give our final thoughts. Okay. So, Lush. Applause to you because I love this. This is what it says it's supposed to be. A skin tint. And it's beautiful. You can build it up. You can build it down. You can, hell, you can layer it on top of stuff. Sorry, underneath of stuff and layer stuff on top of it. So I mean, it's creamy kind of, it's like a cream base. You can't obviously put it over powder. It'll look kind of wonky, I would think. I don't know, but we haven't tried that. But besides the point, I think it's amazing. I love the color. I feel like it's very versatile. So I mean, if you have a deeper skin tone or if you're as fair and pale as I am, I feel like you're gonna love it. And I definitely would give this a thumbs up because it's, it's inexpensive, it's not too expensive, but it's obviously not like elf cheap, but it's beautiful, it's worth the price, and for the amount you get in here and as less of an amount you need to apply to like see anything, thumbs up. Like, great job, Lush. Um, Laura Lee, girl, girl, I freaking love this. Oh my god, I'm so impressed. So, so impressed. This is my, actually my first time trying her products, so like, thumbs up to you, Laura Lee. Like, look at this. Look. You can use these as eyeshadows, hell. If you guys want me to use it in an eyeshadow tutorial, please comment below. I would be more than excited to do it. I just, I just love this. The packaging is beautiful. It feels luxurious. Like, for the price. I mean, I think you're paying, what, $19, which, like I said, I'll double check and put it below. But for the price, you're definitely getting your mother money's worth. Like, these pans are ridiculously large. So, I mean, I'm gone. Like, I'm literally not on this earth anymore. That's how I feel about this. This is beautiful. I just, like, went to heaven and came back. So, this Kylie product... I would give this a thumbs up. Would I say this is, oh my god, out of this world? I've never seen it before. Probably not, just because of how subtle it is. And, like, I mean, the pigment's there. But you kind of have to build it up a little bit more than once or twice. But, I mean, it kind of depends on your preference. Like, I would probably use this as an everyday blush. But if I wanted something a little bit more dramatic, I'd probably would choose a different color. Or I would choose a different brand. But, overall... I like the packaging. I think it's cute. It's Kylie. It's definitely cute. It's pink. I love the color pink. As well as I think it's beautiful. I like the way this looks. I like the formula. It's easy to blend. I would recommend it. But just keep in mind it is something subtle. So if you're looking for something subtle, yes, go and get this girl. Go get this. But if you don't want something subtle, I would probably choose something else. So even though I didn't do my whole face... I just wanted to show you guys a little quick video with some new products, test them out for you. So, 
if you guys love this video please comment below give me any recommendations you've got just keep them coming give this video a thumbs up ring that notification button in the corner i think it's this corner and subscribe please give me lots of love because i love you guys so much thanks for watching bye